Wuthering Wave is coming in a month and in this video I'm gonna tell you 5 things you need to know before starting to play Wuthering Wave. This video took me days to make so please sit down and watch until the end and you will know this thing. Let's begin. First thing first, let's talk about the store. In Wuthering Wave you can go to the store and when you go there, you will see a bundle and you can see there's a level pack. When reaching a certain level, you can open those bundles and you will get some wish as you can see. Also, if we go to the item extent, you can see that there's three type of ways. One for the character, you can change the icon, one for the weapon, and one for the standard character. But that's not all. You can buy 5 star character copy. But you are gonna need the first copy of the character first before buying those copy. And you get that currency by wishing on the banner. Any banner should do. Now, before we go to the second thing, if you are enjoying this type of content, please make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on twitch.tv slash dalex. That would mean a lot. And make sure to watch my beginner video about Withering Wave. That would help you out more. Let's begin. Now, the second thing is the chest. In Withering Wave, there's multiple type of chest. There is the advanced supply chest which give 20 astra as you can see there there is the basic supply chest which give around 5 astra and the last thing is the standard supply chest which give around 10 astra now there is more out there but i won't really spoil you the surprise so just enjoy exploring the third thing is the world exploration shop to access to that, you have to go to this specific place, as you can see, and follow my lead. Now, you can talk to that woman and she will offer you some stuff and you can buy wishes. And that currency that you need is only available when you open chest or do world exploration in general and you will get those currency. Now the fourth thing you need to know is that some NPC will give you some challenge and those challenge will give you a lot of reward as you can see in this video but they are super hard so there is that so please make sure to try to talk with NPC that have exclamation mark because sometimes they can give you challenge and it give a lot of reward the fifth thing is the exploration progress when you go to this place when i'm showing you on the map and talk to the lady you can see that you need some percentage of world exploration to get reward and you will get a lot of reward while exploring and i think this is very important to know because this is where your main reward gonna be here a bonus thing to know is that you can test your character to know how they fight and how they work as you can see in this video where the arrow is that where you can test and you will be in a domain and they will teach you how to play the character you want that's all for now if you did enjoy this video please do subscribe to my youtube channel that help a lot and put a like and also comment down below what do you think and don't forget to follow me on twitch.tv slash dalex and also don't forget to watch my beginner guide video see ya